With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello everyone, let's start with the question. The question says, from the following observation, predict the type of orbital. So we have to predict the type of orbital. The observation number one given to us is XY plane acts as nodal plane. So the XY plane will act as the nodal plane. So let us look at the options and then we'll decide which of them can act. For 5PZ, that is along the P and Z axis, this will be PZ is dumbbell shaped. This will be one dumbbell here, one dumbbell here. This is the Z axis and this is the P axis. The line passing through them will be the, the this line will be the X axis and the Y axis passing straight through them will be the Y axis. So PZ does have XY as a nodal plane. This is for PZ. For XY, it will automatically will not be a nodal plane because XY is a double double shaped structure and it will be along the X axis. That is for X axis, the diagram will be dumbbell, double dumbbell here, double dumbbell here. This will be the X axis and this will be the Y axis. So the X and Y are involved in the dumbbells. That is the node. So X, Y will automatically not be a correct option because the uh, X, Y plane does not act as a nodal plane for six D X square and minus y square it will also be same because the xy plane will not act as the nodal plane so this will also be incorrect let's look for yz yz will be dumbbell shaped dumbbell here yz this is the z axis this is the y axis the line passing through them somewhat look will be this this will be the X and the line passing through them straight will be Y. So X, Y here also act as a nodal plane. Now let us look along with the observation number two. The angular function of the orbital intersect the three axis at origin only. So it will, it has to uh, intersect at origin for first option. It is clear that it is interacting, intersecting only at the origin. This is here. For DXY, it will not be same because these two are intersecting, four are intersecting. One here, one here, one here and one here. For DYZ, this will be same because they are intersecting at the center along the XY plane. Now, we have to look at the observation number three. The curve obtained for the orbital is, for the curve, we will note down the number of radial nodes. And for number of radial nodes, let us look at the graph given to us. Here the node is 1, number 2 and number 3. Now we will we'll use the formula for calculating number of radial nodes. Option 2 and 3 will be incorrect. So we will only find it for option 1 and 4 and then we will decide which of them is correct one. Radial nodes, radial nodes is calculating using the formula is equal to n minus l minus 1. So for PZ, 5PZ, N is equal to 5, L is equal to 1. So for this, the number of radial nodes will be equal to 5 minus 1 minus 1. That is equal to 3. Now let us find it for 6DYZ as well. 6DYZ as well. Here N is 6. And L for this will be equal to L2, number of radial nodes 6 minus 1, N minus, N minus L that is 6 minus 2 minus 1, 3. So these, this is also 3 nodes. So the correct answer will be option 1 and option 4 A and D are correct thank you everyone for class 6 to 12 ITG and NEET level 
ट्रस्टेड बाय मोर देन फाइव करोड़ स्टूडेंट्स डाउनलोड डाउट एंड आप टूडे